Hey, um, I just wanted to do a quick update, so I'm using Quick Capture to do so. Um, something I got into this week. It's nice and easy. Uh, I'll come out with more footage soon about what it's been like reconnecting with my birth family. But I just want to let you all know that thanks for all your responses, good and bad. Um, good ones made me feel really good, obviously, and the bad ones made me laugh. So thank you very much for all your comments. I didn't really expect to get such feedback, um, but I'm, I'm glad I did. There's a thriving internet community out there, obviously, so glad to be a part of it. Um, Tommy, Trina, and Kai. The fam, the birth family, they um, are all doing well right now. I don't think that Tommy or Trina or Kai, for that matter, could be any happier. Um, they're all beautiful people, super kind. We're all very comfortable with each other, my family and their family, all very comfortable meeting. Um, they came down to Philadelphia soon after I made the phone call. So Tommy, Trina, Kai came down. I got to meet them. They got to meet my family, um, grandma, some cousins, my good friend Jed. He filmed it, so hopefully I'll be able to edit something for all of you soon. And after that, a few weeks later, I went to Kai's christening. I got to see him be christened. I'm the Jewish brother. He gets to be the, the Catholic one. It's kind of fun. And... Um, I just had Christmas there, which was a very interesting experience. I went down the first, the night before Christmas, and I stayed over with Tommy, Trina, and Kai. We went to Trina's brother's house, had a lovely time. We got to spend good quality time with that family, really great people there. And I went, we all had our um, Christmas morning together, me, Tommy, Trina Kai, me and Tommy in matching pants, trying to get Kai to crawl, um, having just a really nice time. We were really late for Christmas dinner that night, but that's when my parents um, and grandma and my cousin Hope all came, and we went to Tommy's sister's house, and we all had dinner with that side of the family, and that was a wonderful time too. You know, every everyone's just better than the next. Uh, and that goes in full circle, which is to say everyone's just great. Uh, the comfort is pretty amazing, and the love is a little bit overwhelming, but, you know, if you put yourself into their shoes, you can maybe understand it a little better. Um, so right now my life's crazy, and I like it like that. Um, I couldn't really ask for anything more, and just going rolling with it. We'll see what happens. It's a pretty wonderful story. If anyone else has any happy story like this or any sad story, I'd love to hear them. Um, I don't really know if I've heard any story that, that's worked out this well in terms of adoption. I was actually really surprised to see how many uh, negative responses to adoption there are. But mine's very positive and should be very exciting. It's great to have a little brother. It's great to know that, um, well, it's a little depressing, but it's probably, you know, in the long run better to know all the genetic problems that I'll develop over time, perhaps. Um, all the ailments I may get. At least I can be weary, and at least I know what to look out for in terms of always being late like Trina or having a little bit high cholesterol. Um, yeah, what more can I say? It's been really good. I think we're all really happy with how things are turning out. And it's exciting. Every day brings something new. So um, thanks again for all your responses. And I'll get another installment of that documentary out soon, I hope. It's my last semester of school, so kind of need a job. Hopefully that job will help me finish this documentary or keep it going. But... Um, We'll see how that goes. Other than that, hope you're all doing well, and uh, talk to you all soon. Love you. Bye.